Hello and welcome to Detox Bites episode 19. Today I'm going to be showing you how to make my absolute favourite raw dessert, um, it's a raw banoffee pie. It was inspired by my cousin Heidi at Sweet Greens Cafe in Bournemouth, um, although she used one or two elements that were cooked um, and I've adapted it to make it completely raw. Now, while I call this dessert a raw banoffee pie, it's almost more of a raw banana coconut pie. Um, so it's got three layers, and for the base layer, you're going to need chopped nuts, um, medjool dates, uh, coconut oil, and agave. So it's up to you what kind of nuts you use, but for this recipe, I've got um, one cup, half of almonds, and half of pecans. Um, and first step is just to pop them in the food processor and blend them into a kind of powder. Um, next up, we're just going to add to the crumbly mixture um, some medjool dates. Um, I've got 12 here, they're quite large dates, um, so you might want to add more or less depending on which dates you've got. I'm also just going to add um, half a spoon of coconut oil just to help the mixture kind of blend together. Um, and then you just need to pulse the, um, the mixture in the food processor. Um, it might take a couple of minutes because you want to get quite a gooey, uh, sticky consistency but also still with some little crunchy bits in. So this is the kind of consistency that you're looking for. So once you've reached um, that kind of consistency, we're just going to spoon the mixture into um, the bottom of the cake tin, um, spread it out and press it down around the whole base of the tin. Just spreading it out around the tin. So the next step is to make the banana middle layer. Um, and what you'll need for this is two large bananas um, they need to be quite ripe. Um, if they are um, green, they won't, they'll be a bit too solid to go mushy. So peel both bananas, break them up a bit so they're easier to mush. Um, and just to add a bit of liquid to it, we're just going to put some agave in there. It just it adds some really lovely sweetness and makes it easier to mush. And then you just need to spend a couple of minutes making the, mixed, the banana really, really mushy. So ideally you'd get almost quite a liquidy banana consistency. So next you just need to pour the mashed banana um, into the tin on top of the base layer. So with the second part of the middle layer, um, I'm going to get a third banana and slice it um, quite finely. Um, and the reason we need to slice it quite finely is because it needs to spread across the whole um, width of the tin. Um, and then just place the slices of banana on top of the mashed banana. This creates a firmer layer for the top part of the pie to go on top of. For the top creamy layer, um, I'm going to use coconut cream. Um, you can use either coconut cream, you can get the little tins of it, or um, if you can't get any coconut cream, then when you buy a tin of coconut milk, it's the top layer that goes a bit more solid, and um, that also will work really well. So I've used two tins. Um, I've actually mixed coconut cream and the top layer of coconut milk um, for this one. So the coconut cream mixture needs to be whisked. Um, you can either use a hand whisk, do it yourself, or like me, you can cheat and use the whisk in my food processor. Um, and I'm also going to add a teaspoon of vanilla powder and a teaspoon of banana powder um, for extra bananariness. So this is the kind of consistency you'll get. It won't ever go as fluffy and as light as dairy cream, um, but it does still kind of have a bit more body than if you just put it straight on top. And similarly to the other layers, I'm just gonna pour the coconut cream on top of the banana layer um, and spread it finely all over. So the final step is just to dust it with some raw cacao powder for decoration.
once you finish decorating it, it just needs to go in the fridge to set um, and also needs to be kept in the fridge when you're not scoffing your face with it. So there you have it, banoffee pie, completely raw and absolutely delicious. So the ingredients are all in the description below, along with the method. And you can buy vanilla powder, banana powder, raw cacao powder and coconut oil from this recipe from us at Detox Trading. Just go to our website www.detoxtrading.co.uk or click on the link below. And happy raw eating!